Trailer City, it's just Trailer City all the time. Everybody's trying to release trailers leading up to Christmas, obviously, or maybe before they want to release it before Star Wars. I don't know, but it's just trailers constantly. Hi guys, welcome to No Bites, and this is going to be my views and thoughts on the new trailer for Star Trek Beyond. So we've been surprised with yet another trailer, it's the first official trailer for the third instalment of the Star Trek rebooted franchise, Star Trek Beyond, uh, with Chris Pine and all the other people all back in, the, uh, in their characters. Now this film I'm really looking forward to, I was looking forward to this film as well and I'm still looking forward to it, um, and I'm, even though J.J. Abrams isn't directing anymore, I'm still looking forward to the film, I enjoyed the other ones, it's because of him I got back into this, it got into this franchise in the first place really, I was never a massive Star Trek fan. So I am looking forward to this film, however this trailer didn't really work for me. The action scenes were awesome and everything I saw, seeing all the characters again in new suits, new space battles, all this kind of stuff, but the theme of the trailer didn't work for me with the Beastie Boys theme tune over the top and it was just quippy one-liners, action, 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 action and title. It was just, it was, it seemed like some kind of Seth Rogen action comedy type thing and it didn't work for this franchise. If you look at all the other trailers for the old, old two films, that they're all very well, a lot more serious, a lot more heartfelt, emotional and deep in these characters and that someone's going to get killed and it's going to be desperate and, you know what I mean, all that kind of serious stuff. But with this it's kind of like, hey, we're Star Trek, we're going to blow stuff up, we're going to do this, we're going to do that, and funny one-liners, way! It's just kind of like, stupid, didn't really work for me. I, I can't deny the action looks awesome and the little one-liners I still quite enjoy because we have that sprinkled throughout with obviously the character of Bones and... Um, Jim Kirk having this cockiness, we, we love that, but this trailer, I'm just speaking of that trailer, didn't really work for me. Apart from that, I mean, we didn't really get anything, we didn't get any detail about what's going on in the film, I mean, which is fine, because it's the first trailer, but I would have liked some kind of, this is what we're doing. I assume it's the five year mission that they talked about at the end of Into Darkness, but I don't know, it was literally just action shot, action shot, this, that, this, that, song over the top, boom, title, and it was... It didn't really show, you know, tell you anything. The action shots were cool, the funny bits were cool, but the trailer as a whole for me just didn't work. Also, just so you know, I will be reviewing the new Star Wars film. I'm so looking forward to seeing it. I'm going to go see it twice, and I cannot wait to review it, so make sure you look out for that video, because it's going to be awesome. So that's what I thought of the Star Trek Beyond trailer. What did you think about it? Let me know down in the comments or send me an email. You can also find me in the various social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and moviepilot.com. Just type in Nerd Bites anywhere and I'm sure you'll find me. And don't forget to like, subscribe and share my videos. And of course, keep it nerdy.